Hey guys, welcome to another video. So I was just getting ready and I was like, okay, I'm gonna film this because why not? So here's a get ready with me video. I hope you all enjoy it. So if you're interested, keep on watching. And as I always say, here's my Instagram, my Snapchat, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. So yeah, I'm starting off with wetting my Unreal Technique sponge with some water and I'm using my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in what is it? NW45. And I just use this like under my eyes first and like whatever like kind of like acne scars or you know dark marks. I like to cover that up first before I put on my foundation. So that's what I'm doing here. I really love the Real Technique sponge. It's only like $7 and some change and it works really good. So here's my Lancome foundation. I'm using my Beauty Blender sponge and no particular reason that I'm using like this sponge instead of the other, the other sponge I just like to like use different sponges so yeah I love this foundation very good long lasting good coverage buildable all that good stuff so yeah I'm using this here pressing it into my skin making sure I'm going it out blending is very important so you know, that's why I'm taking such a long time to blend it out so yeah, blah, 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 blah. I need a, be a new beauty blender by the way thing is ripped Anyway, so here's my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC45. This is like a really good color. Like if you're like kind of chocolatey like around my skin tone, like this is a good like, I don't know, it's like warm. It's just a very, very nice like highlighting color that I like to use. So that's what I'm doing here. And I like to always go over my um, eyelids and yeah. I'm making sure I, you know, highlight the areas, high points of my face, and adding some more. So before I didn't used to like um put concealer like on the over the like whole top part of my lip like this, but you know, then I started like I always had the issue where like it looked weird, like oh your concealer just stopping like by your nose. And then my glass all in me, and I was like, okay, it's gonna make sense. You're supposed to go all the way down, like, and complete it. Like, you can't just stop under your eyes by your nose. So, yeah. Changed my makeup game. So, now I have to, like, put my concealer, you know, above my eyes. Hello. Okay, so here's the Ben Nye Topaz powder. I have the banana as well, but, um, I guess when I like to, when I'm just, like, going, like, to the mall or, like, just a regular day when I still want to look good, and I want to like set my concealer I like to use topaz and then you know I started like noticing that it's really it's actually like a good powder like, I kind of doubted it before like I guess I wasn't using it right but like it's good like even if I was going to like a party or something like I probably could use topaz if I wanted to and, yeah and I decided to use topaz today and it was a little traumatized how I was looking in my last video so I was like nah I can't be looking ashy all the time Shout out to my friend Chi Chi pointing it out, even though I already knew. But yes, so set your face. And now I'm taking my MAC Mineral Skin Finish Powder in Dark Deep. And what I like to do is I get the powder onto the brush and then I press it in. I don't like um, brush it. I press it on the areas that I didn't highlight. So like press it in so it sets the foundation as well. You know, you gotta set stuff. You're using liquid stuff or creams like you have to set it so it doesn't move and so you don't look like I don't know like melted crayons so yeah so yeah that's what I'm doing I'm setting in it's also bringing back you know some of the color back in my face so today I was like okay let's do some brown I didn't really know what I was doing to be honest I was just like okay we're gonna start with this I always start with my crease anyway so I was like okay let's take some brown whatever put in the crease and we'll move on from there. And I kind of wanted like a dark eye, like a dark um, brown eye, but I don't know, my plans didn't work out. I don't know, I just ended up with what I ended up with. So yeah, I'm using my Coastal Scents palette that I always use because it's bomb and it has every color that I need and yeah. So I'm using that and yeah, I love it. It's awesome. Like. Are you kidding me? Like I haven't even I feel like I only use like five colors in this palette. Like when am I ever gonna use the rest of these palette these colors? I don't know. But yeah. So I'm gonna start experimenting with colors because I don't really use colors like that. Like for what? 
Like, what do I look like with colors on my eyes going around, like, to the shop right? But anyway, yeah, so I was like, okay, I don't want to just do brown today. So I just took the gold and I put it in the middle. And now in hindsight, I'm like, oh, I should have just left it brown, but this looks nice too. So yeah, put the gold in the middle. There you go. Ooh, shout out to my eyebrows. Like, they're looking real good right now. But anyway, so I have this e.l.f. complexion brush that I'm using to brush off the um, excess topaz. And just like, I don't know, just make everything look all seamless brushing all the powders into each other but yeah shout out to my eyebrows like okay like they look really nice and that's my Anastasia dip brown I have a tutorial on eyebrows and I actually don't like that video so I might make another one but yeah so this is a covergirl ebony um covergirl bronzer in the color ebony bronze a staple you know you can't go wrong with it sorry yeah, yeah, say, you gotta see when you make your video though. yes never would have made it but anyway, um, um, yeah. <laughs> so I'm bronzing up my temples, my, you know, contouring my cheeks, carving my face, snatching my nose, all of the above, you know, guess, 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 guess. Like, this is, contouring has really changed the game, like, like, thank God for contouring. But yeah, so I'm using this sleek, um, contour kit in dark. And I like it because the powder is like just a tad bit darker. It's not really showing here, but like it just gives me that little cut that I like. Chisel. So this is a Milani um, baked bronzer. And I like it because it's just like, it's not like, so if anyone knows like MAC um, Gold Deposit. It's like really, really shimmery and you use it as a highlighter. I like using the baked to like just go all over. And yeah, make me shimmery, but not too shimmery. And yeah, so this is Becca Cosmetics so Opal. You know, I love it. Like, yes, I'm shining. I'm really shining right now. Like, come on. What? Anyway, so here's my NYC liquid eyeliner. Like, this is a good eyeliner. Like, I don't know why I ever stopped using it, but it's so good. So that's why I went and bought it again. So yeah, that's what I'm using. And it's actually good for like people that don't really know how to do like, um, cat eyes and wing liner like you can really practice and it's just so easy to use Gosh. it's good sorry if i'm offending anyone with my naps by my closure <laughs> but if you notice i don't care about naps i don't care i don't care it's my hair texture okay like i embrace i love it so if you have an issue with my naps i'm sorry i like the naps I like them to show. Okay. Anyway, so here are my lashes. These are just some random um, kiss. They're probably are they kiss? Yeah. I don't know. It's beauty store lashes, whatever. So yeah, I'm just like I got some glue on my lashes on my um lid. So I was covering it with the gold shadow. You know, covering the band, lash band, any area that got like a little messy. Now my handy dandy trusty mascara. And you know I always use this mascara. I gotta buy another one because this is like dried out almost. But yeah. So that I'm doing here. So I'm doing the bomb lashes. Very important. In my last tutorial, like you can't be a baddie without like popping bottom lashes. So just you just have to take the time to like make them show. So if you wanna be a baddie work on your bottom lashes and even if you don't have any like you just need to just put a lot of mascara and they will come to life some way somehow if there's a will there's a way if there's a way there's a will anyway so i'm taking this brown um coastal scents powder that i just love and putting on my lashes and i'm taking some gold and i'm putting in my um tear ducts so i can have that little pop and so that when I like look at people, my eyes glisten. And people are like, oh my gosh, she looks so cute. She's so pretty. Uh. Alright, it's not real conceited. But I like that's why I like the silver. Anyway, so here's the brown, a light tan. Put it under your eyebrows, you know. Set that concealer. Get your little eyebrow highlight. And I'm taking that cocoa again. And I'm using it on my eyebrows because I feel like when I brush the powder, like the topaz and face powder off, my eyebrows get like white and chalky. So I like to take this powder and, you know, fill them in. And now we're going to finish off with our setting spray. And of course my camera will go out of focus. But anyway, setting spray. I'm going to make a video. I'm not going to comment on this setting spray. I'm not going to comment right now. Anyway, ColourPop. One of the best liquid lipsticks ever. In the color, more better. 
just love this color like it made me feel like winter time like when I originally bought it I was like oh my gosh I need to wear a sweater like this color is making me feel like I need to drink some hot chocolate so yeah I love this color and I have Vaseline on so I noticed that it didn't dry so I guess if you want it to dry don't have like Vaseline on your lips but yeah of course I need my chains and I'm trying to adjust this sweater oh yeah so this is my perfume I got this Puerto Rico and it smells really good but yeah we're all done shout out to my friend Debbie she got me the sweater for my for Christmas and Chi Chi got me the big bar answer so thanks Chi Chi and Debbie but yeah, so, you know, styling it, trying to figure it out, trying not to show my chestices and stuff, and figuring out my life, finding my lighting. Yes, okay, it's a nice, big sweater. Love it, yeah. Okay, of course, honorary posing, and yeah, okay. Thanks for watching, bye!